Hello everybody, and welcome back to Landmark. Well, we haven't done one of these videos in an awful long time. As you know, for people that follow my channel for a long time, I have done a couple of videos on Landmark and various creations that I, I made, just to uh, show you what I've done. Um, but since the news that Landmark is being released in spring, which is any time, <laughs> according to uh, Daybreak Games. I thought I would give a look after the massive update that they've just done, a uh, 48 hour update that they've put into the into Landmark. Now as you may remember, uh, over 12 months ago, Daybreak Games said they were cutting back their development-ish of Landmark and focusing completely on EverQuest Next, and again, as you know, last week, um, Russ Shanks, I believe his name is, uh, the president of Daybreak Games, announced that they are discontinuing development of EverQuest Next, closely followed by the announcement that Landmark would be released. The reason for discontinuing the EverQuest Next development, apparently was, when they put it all together, it wasn't fun. Really? <laughs> I mean, that is the excuse they actually put out. It wasn't fun. <laughs> I was completely gobsmacked that they would even consider putting that out. I wasn't particularly looking forward to EverQuest Next. As you know, it was an action-type combat kind of game. I'm never too keen on those. I mean, I prefer the old tab target. So I would prefer the EverQuest Next or EverQuest 3 to have been a continuation of the EverQuest franchise. But they decided to go the cartoony, graphic version, and the action combat. So I wasn't too bothered about it, but it had some interesting ideas with it. With the AI, the AI moving creatures uh, from certain spots where they determined determine they were going to get attacked, they would move on somewhere else. Or they would try and attack another faction. It all sounded very interesting, so I wanted to see what it was going to be like. But that's not going to happen now. EverQuest Next is dead. So we've got to get used to that. I was just upset the way they, they did it, really. And to say that it wasn't fun, I don't think is an excuse. And I think that the community deserved a better explanation for that and they had their ideal opportunity to give an explanation yesterday during the live stream that they did uh, to explain all the new updates for Landmark it would have taken what maybe 10 minutes of the time just for somebody in real life to turn around to the community and tell them the real reason why it wasn't being brought to fruition. That's all it's saying. Ten minutes, and it might have allayed a little bit of the the PR, PR disaster that they've had with getting rid of EverQuest Next, and <laughs> may I say, with releasing Landmark in almost the next breath, when they'd practically discontinued the development of this. Right, so there's my minor rant out of the way. Now let's see what they've done with this update. I did try and log in um, a few hours ago uh, with no success, and then I, I logged in again, and I actually managed to get in. Uh, but nothing seemed to be working properly, so I, I came straight out again, uh, a bit angry. So I've logged in again, uh, just to see if anything's happened. The, apparently the server's coming down. So I'm hoping that maybe they've changed a few things. Right, here we go. We have a starting outfit to start. We either have the fantasy gear, the sci-fi gear, or the western gear. Not interested in any of them, to be quite honest. Um, put in my name. There we are. All grey. And my name should still be there from uh, the beta. I've been in the beta for a couple of years, so... 
Right, let's see what we can do with this size. Now, you're supposed to be able to change this uh, anything from the small size up to the large size. And in between. But it appears the same as when I tried to log in earlier. The slider doesn't work. You have two choices. <laughs> small or large. Oh dear. I mean, come on Daybreak. I mean, this is the first contact with the game. And the first thing you get is a broken slider that only gives you large and small. It's the first thing that you do. Oh. Right, okay. <laughs> I'm starting to lose my temper a little bit. And people know I don't do that very often. I'm quite a calm person. Right face, okay, I can't see the face on that one, so I'll have to go on that one for a minute. Right, let's have a look at the face. No, no, no. Well, yeah, that's me at the moment, actually. Is that it? Three faces. Really? Yeah, well, I will keep the angry face then. Skin tone, don't care. Hair, ah, that's alright. Hair colour. No point in being called all grey unless it's got that. Let's have the whiter one. Yep. Facial hair. Don't want any. There we go. Eye colour. Can't see. Can't get close enough. Ah, that'll do. Uh, let's start with the twin guns. I always wanted to be a cowboy. Not. Let's create. I mean, what are they going to do with all the, the classes that we saw? What, a couple of years ago now? During SOE Live, they, they actually showed us some of the classes. Could they not implement those into this in some way? I know I'm clutching at the straws. But, well, let's see what happens when we get in. Uh, as you may know, uh, the islands are now called landscapes, I think it was. Uh, your uh, claims are called building plots. Alright, greetings, Luminary. Yes, okay. Hello. Let's make... Let's make the game better together. <laughs> oh dear, are you having a laugh? You totally ignored people for the last two years. Oh dear. Oh, sorry about that. Oh dear, that's made me eyes water that. Right, uh, this is the new build plot. It's bigger than the old um, claim, I believe. Well, it looks it, it is bigger. Um, it's flat. Apparently the newbie zones, or I can't remember what they call them now. These new landscapes. There's a newbie one that everybody gets sent to. And it's completely flat to make it easier and they've introduced a new it's supposed to be new user experience um, right so I've logged in I've never played landmark before I've got I'm being told to press tab to open build mode all right I press tab Ah, there we go. Oh, that's it. Takes its time to work, doesn't it? Castle Courtyard design placed. Right, I've got to place the Castle Courtyard. Right, where do I want to place the Castle Courtyard? Should that be in the middle? <laughs> oh, um, right, let's see what I can do with it first. Hello? Ah, there it is. Wow, that's slow. 
Ouais, ok. Euh... How do we get to that to shrink it R? Apparently. That doesn't seem to have worked. No. Okay, R's not working. I want to reduce the size. As you can plainly see, it says R. I'd have to hold it. Nope. Alright, it's at an angle, so let's try... Let's try E. Oh, E works. And Q. Q works. Z. Z works. R. R doesn't work. It doesn't want to let me to resize this. Alright, let's go back to E. That's, no, I don't want that one. I want the one that goes sideways. So how do we get onto that? Okay, tab gets rid of it. Right, I've been on it two minutes and I'm already confused. I wanted to shrink it down and do a small version of a castle. Of a castle. <laughs> Rather than making all this into a castle. I just wanted to make a little one. Let's try it again. Right, R. Okay, that doesn't seem to want to do anything. And as usual, I start recording, the dog starts barking. Absolutely ridiculous. I'll be right back. Alright, okay, I'm back. Just, as usual, it was the posty man. Alright, I don't know where I can put this, where it'll fit into. That's the top. Oh god, it's slow. Why does it take so long? I just want to get the... Alright, okay, let's just dump it down. Come on. And it's frozen. Oh dear. Alright, let's just put it down. There we go. Alright, so now we have... Wall entry, design placed, corner, wall medium. Right. Which one shall we put it in? Let's put it in this corner here, shall we? If we can. Wall corner. Why has that gone to the bottom? No, it's got a thing in here. I don't want to put it there. Wow, it's, everything's very slow. There we go. No, oh, don't want it that way. Would help if I could actually see which way this is supposed to go. Is it that way? Is it that way? There we go, it must be that way. 
Let's put it there. Um, wall. Long? Wall medium? <laughs> really? <laughs> wall entry let's get level with this see if we can put it here on this end let's put that there And then castle wall long. <laughs> Oops. Oopsies. <laughs> um how does one cancel that? command what was the old command to go back um, no let's have a look see if it's in here game settings General, that's not going to be it, is it? Is it in there? Customize controls, here we go. I can't really see that unless it's back. What's tweet mode? No, I don't want that. I don't want that. I don't want delete to. All I need to do is go back.
I completely put that in the wrong place. Must be a way to go back. What was the old... I can't remember where the old control was for that. Oh well, we've placed it. Not to worry. Uh, medium. Oh, I've got to place two corners, have we? I need to delete that. That's really, really going to wind me up. Right. Here we go. Let's do it the old fashioned way, shall we? Come on, go up. <sighs> All right, that's gone too deep there. I need to bring that back a little bit. I think, yes, bring that to there. Then can we delete? Yes, we can. Wow. I've not played it for a long time, I actually managed to remember that. Uh, that's wrong there though. How can we get that? No, 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 don't want that. Has that done it? As near as damn it, I think. Alright, does that mean that we can put in the corner piece now with the other one? Place a corner. Uh, build. Castle wall corner. Oops. E. Entry. All right, can we fit that in there somehow? Yes, we can. There we go. And what's the last piece we need to put in? Medium wall. And we need to switch that to E. Medium chest prop. No idea how we do that. I thought they were supposed to have changed this so it was <laughs> new user friendly. Uh, props, is that? Furniture. Nope. Seating, storage, chest, simple medium chest prop. All right, okay. Uh, 
Alright, I can just go there. Open. Do I have to come out of... No. There we go. Open. We have got a new... Discovery. Or achievement, is it they call it? Achievement. I don't know what they call it in this now. They've changed the name of that as well. Right, wood harvested. Ore and gems harvested. Here we go. Are we having fun yet, guys? <laughs> uh, right. Uh, we've got an inventory. Let's have a look. Um, okay, I thought we already had those. What's that? Let's pull that on. Let's put that there. That's got to be better than that, surely. What's that? Oh, we have another uh, oh site expansion. Right, we'll be using that holiday gift box. Let's get those. Oh, that's a bit better. There we are. Wow, that's slow. That's going to take about a month to do this. <laughs> wow. All right. Some more there. Let's get that. I don't remember this pick being this slow. I really don't remember it being this slow. <laughs> this seems painful. Mind you, I had uh, I did have a lot of upgraded weapons and tools on the old landmark before this. All right, that's it. Let's get out of there before you die. Oh, go too deep. Uh, let's try another tree. I suppose that now we've actually created the castle walls and the courtyard and what have you, it's not asking us to do anything else like that, we could actually pull up stakes and move to the uh, normal islands. I don't know how to do that, but we'll, we can have a look uh, while we're collecting stuff. No, we'll, no we'll, we'll stay on the newbie island just for the hell of it. Uh, 
I've learned flame-bound cuirass. What the hell? Elite Ebon Guard Captain. Oh, right, okay. Looks like I've learned some uh, new skills, craftable items, somehow. Is that by harvesting and forestry and uh, mining? Forestry? Is that a real word? <laughs> really? I'm trying to give this a, a, a reasonable chance. I'm trying not to be too negative, even though I do feel rather negative about it. Alright, so we've got over 1,060 so far, so that's, pre that's going pretty quick. On the upside. I was expecting to be more nodes that you can see. There doesn't seem to be very many. Oh, it appears you get lumen for harvesting as well. I just saw that pop up on the uh, the loot table there on the left, top left. Yeah, there we go. Lumen, again. How are we doing? Well, we're... We're getting there. Hello, Robin. Let's try a smaller tree. I suppose we'd need to create our own... Uh, crafting table, or whatever they call it. In order to make... Some new harvesting tools. Not quite sure how long this episode will be. I want to try and uh, get a few more of these achievements completed before I finish the episode. Just to see how we're doing, really. I'm taking it, it's telling you to uh, harvest these ore and gems so that you can make crafting tables, I'm hoping. What's a point? Can we check that? Yes, we can. Oh, uh, this is the highlight. The highlighted stuff is what we've got. That's not what we've not what we've not got. Right. Okay. far to go now, we're nearly there. It just doesn't feel like it used to do, for some reason. Whether that's because this is so slow, and doesn't do as much damage as the others, I, I don't know. Go on, get rid of that. Only about another two days, folks, and then we'll, we'll get all these 
collectibles. Harvestables, whatever they're called. Exactly having fun <laughs> yet. Hello, Robin. Nearly there. Come on. Can we get it off this node? Maybe. No. Let's move on to another one. that one dirt ice okay <laughs> there we go that's done whoops let's get these trees done And hopefully it will tell us that we can make our crafting table. Or do we need to go to uh, the spires to do that? Because we don't have a table to craft it on. That's a point. Nearly there. I wonder how far they really did get with EverQuest next. I wonder if they got everything together and that when they did put it together. I wonder if they had everything that they wanted, like the AI and everything. I really would like to know that, how far they did get with it. Like I say, we did see, two years ago, we saw the, some of the classes in action and it looked, it looked pretty decent to me. Very action-y, obviously, but... No, we don't want that, do we? No, 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 we want the big... Let's go for a big tree. Because we're nearly there. Come on. I do like the music in EverQuest Next. Or oh, Landmark it is now. Travel menu opened. Uh, okay. Does that mean I have to go back to my... Claim? Oh, sorry. Build site? Oops. Do I, is, this, is this it here? No, it's a spawn point. Uh, okay, I'll get rid of that first, do we? Move, I don't want to move. Link. 
No, that's not it. Uh, travel menu, how do we do that? Would be nice if you gave us a clue. Trouble menu. What's that there? Is that it? Flying character camera. Oh, right, okay. Nope. Okay, you tell us to do that, but you don't tell us how to do it. What's that? Is that it? Trouble menu. Oh, there we go. Would it be nice if you told us that? Uh, travel back to your build site. Oh, right, okay, I was supposed to do that from out here, was I? Oh, I was taking to the spires. There's a crafting table. Weapon, accessory. Really? Gadgets, what's that? No. Extractor. Couldn't do that yet. All right. Got to travel back to my build site. Done. Lumen station opened. Lumen station. Right. Dungeon builder starter sect. Unlocked with lumens. Okay. Baron Flame Blade character placed. All right, monsters. It's, oh, it's, no, it's, that's not it. It's Baron.
Baron Flame Blade. Oh, it says Baron. Right, we'll try and work this out, and I think this will be the last thing that we do today on this on this episode. Well, there's Baron. Is it me not seeing this? Is that supposed to be a flame blade? Baron Bowman character placed. And where would they be? Try tab. Replicator. Oh, we can place it and all. Uh, Alright, let's place that there. Nice. It's not exactly what we were supposed to be doing, but while we're there. Characters. Alright, oh, okay, here we go. Maybe I already had these. Baron Bowman. Baron Bowman. Flame Blade. Switch your build site to play mode. Well, I don't like the sound of that. Equip your starter weapon. Take you out to go out of that. How do you get to your character? P and C don't seem to work. Oh, right, there it is, five. I've equipped my starter weapon. Character H. Wow, well that's very intuitive. Oh. 
Oh, all right, done it, yeah. Okay. Press left mouse button for base because it's tight. All right, I saw that already. Press right mouse button. Baron Flame Blade defeated hasn't come up. Okay. Wait for that. There we go. Build site management window opened. Right, first of all, I need to escape that. Switch to edit mode. Pick them up, I don't want them killing me when I'm not looking. Build side management window. seem to be it either. Ah, build side management. Build site name customized. Really? Hello? Oh, great part, don't love to do. Okay, gallery opened with B key. Right, that's easy enough. Next, all grey has become a luminary. All right, okay. Well, that appears to be the end of the tutorial, then, folks. Uh. Interesting. I think I'll probably end up picking up this claim and moving to the other worlds. Can we pick that up? Yeah, pick that up. Reclaim. Let's move to the portal. Before we end this episode, let us have a quick look at the other world, or worlds, if we can. <laughs> world travel, continent travel. Where do we want to go? Where do we want to get our site? We don't want Pioneer Islands. All these have no claims on them, that's weird. And they're all tier 1. Uh, let's have a look at Arid Thicket. That's the first one on there. And there we have it. 
crash bang wallop. Alright folks, it's the end of the episode for us. Let me know what you think. <laughs> this is All Grey, signing off. <laughs>